Hi, it's Kelly from Chestnut Junction, and we're going to talk about e-patterns and mobile devices. I myself don't print from my mobile devices. I print from my home computer straight to my printer. It's all connected together. Um, so I'm not real familiar with this. I've had to search online. Um, I've taken some notes, and um, I'm going to, if you see me look at my paper, that's my notes. But I'm going to try to real quickly um, let you know like what I've looked up. If anybody has any better information, put it in the comments below. Um, we have an Android phone right here. If you are using an Android, um, your files are going to get uh, saved in your Google Cloud. And there is a um, app for the Android that's called Let's Print Droid. And then you have to get an additional um, app for that called Let's Print a PDF. And that one is for the Android. Um, if you are using a Kindle, the uh, your uh, file, whenever you do a Kindle, is going to go to the Amazon Cloud. Once you get to the Amazon Cloud, there is, um, at least whenever we opened this up, there was an app called Mopria Print um, that you could print from your Kindle. Um, lastly, and this is going to be your iPad or your iPhone, um, whenever you save from there, um, they are that will go to your cloud and um on this one on the apple products you can print from ibooks or you can download adobe acrobat to print from um the one problem though we're looking at and um i'm not real familiar with this uh here again if you know anything different put it below that way people can see it who are having problems with this um i'm understanding that uh, to print from your mobile device, your mobile device has to be hooked up to your home Wi-Fi and you need to have a wireless network, um, meaning that your mobile device is wirelessly in a network with your printer. They're talking to each other. Um, if you are using your mobile device with just your data that, um, you know, you're buying through like AT&T or Verizon, um, that's meaning your that's data on your phone. That's not Wi-Fi. Um, so if that's if I'm understanding right, um, if you don't have a wireless wireless network with home Wi-Fi and you're just using data, you are going to have to take your mobile device to your local print shop um, to have your e-pattern printed. Uh, the best way to do that um, is whenever you open up your file on your mobile device. Um, They'll have a send button, you know, to send or save. Um, send, send or save that email or send or save that file to your email. Um, that way it's, it's just easy to access. Whenever you get to the print shop, you don't have to go looking for it. You've got it in your email. But whenever you get to the print shop, they are either going to have a text um, number or they're going to have an email that you can send them that file. And then they'll receive that file on their end and they can print that out for you. And um, I know Staples does it. Walmart might do it too. And I know there's services too, too that you, that's why I even say with the email, if you can get that file into your email, um, you can email these files online to your local print shop and um, they can have it ready for you whenever you get there. You know, you you can still walk in, but it's, you know, to save time, you can email them those files. If you get to the print shop, and this has happened to me several times, I've had customers um, actually email me from the, print, from the print shop, and they're like, they won't print my patterns. They say they're copyrighted. And um, I'm going to go ahead and tell you, um, you can print, um, I normally only say one, you know, just print one e-pattern but I'm gonna go ahead and tell you and if you want to show them the video show them the video you can print two e-patterns um, because if you've had to take all this trouble to go and drive all the way to your print shop you know and something happens with the one of the patterns that you printed um, at least you're gonna have a backup you know print so I'm gonna let you you know print two patterns and you know you can tell them there at the print shop that um, if anybody has any more information about this this um, subject, like I said, go ahead and um, write it below um, because I'm 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 not really familiar with all of this. Um, as always, I appreciate your time. I appreciate your support. Um, you can find us at www.chestnutjunction.com and our Etsy shop www.etsy.com/shop/chestnutjunction.